Welcome to Chef for One Day. My name's Amy. Today I'm just going to try to show you a quick tip. If you ever have to cook pasta and if you happen to eat hard boiled eggs, you can do both at the same time in the same pot. I some eggs in a large pot with some water. So, since I have to boil the eggs, I've gone ahead and put them into the pot. You're going to put the eggs in when the water is cold. And we're going to go ahead and turn this on high. And then, once it comes to a boil, we are going to add our pasta, which in this case is going to be elbow macaroni, obviously. And then we're going to add the macaroni. We're going to put a lid on it, and then we're going to let it sit for 18 minutes. Okay, guys, it's been exactly 18 minutes since I put the lid on. So I'm going to take my eggs out. Whoops, <laughs> if I can grab it. And we're going to put it in some ice water to stop the cooking. Okay, so I'm going to do this. Now I'm going to take the noodles, and I'm going to use half of these noodles to make mac and cheese for lunch. And I'm going to drain this, put, it, put half of them back into the pot, and I'll be right back with that in just a moment. Okay, guys, so here's our macaroni. I drained it. I put half of them back in. Um, you put it back into the pot because the heat from the pot will evaporate the water and that's what you want to happen. If need be, you may want to turn on the burner to just low. We have some Velveeta cheese, just regular Velveeta, two pats of real butter, about one-fourth cup of milk. And I think I'm going to go ahead first actually and add our butter. Use. Okay, so now I'm just going to take my little bit of milk here, and I think I'm only going to use about half. Alright guys, I went ahead and added the Velveeta cheese, and it was approximately one half of a cup, I believe, of the cheese. Now all I'm going to do is put a lid on this. You can still see there's steam coming up off, I think. You can see that. Um, so I'm just going to put a lid on it so that cheese can melt, and while I do that, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, empty the water out of the eggs and go ahead and crack one and see how it turns out. We'll be right back. A little paper towel and I'll use the knife I used to cut the cheese. This is and just some uh, chili powder and some dried so with that, herbs. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video and with that live, love, and eat and we will talk to you again later.